We are not victims. We're not in harm's way. They're taking away thousands of jobs but saying we're safer? That doesn't make sense. How are we safer? We're unemployed. We have no jobs. We have no income. There's plenty of these people with kids. I'm an army vet. I was injured. I can't do very much else. So for people to take away jobs for things like touching our own breasts, they're fucking mine. Let us dance! 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 These riots are selective enforcement. It is the continuation of assault on women. It is the continuation of an assault on working class people who are just trying to get by. We deserve the right to work and to make money in the job of our own choice. We belong here. And we will not just easily surrender our street. This is how we make our livelihood. I started dancing because my mother has lupus. And she couldn't afford her medication. And I couldn't afford my tuition. And when I showed up to my office and asked them, what can I do so that way I don't have to drop out of school, the registration lady looked at me and said, I don't know, but we accept cash or checks. So I started dancing. And I paid for her medication. And I paid for my registration. Their political agenda will not cost me my future. for over 10 years. It's provided me the ability to travel around the world to over 80 countries. I was able to buy my house, completely pay off my tuition, take care of my sister set, and take care of myself through my whole life. I'm a waitress. My son was diagnosed with autism. He has to be at therapy at three different therapies a day. I literally waitress so that I can get my son to therapy. If I don't have this job, I don't know how I'm gonna pay for my son to go for 30 minutes of speech for $45 for 30 minutes, two times a week, that equals to 360 a month. Tell me another job that's gonna help me take care of my son, please, somebody tell me. What you are seeing are young women being coerced by the city's actions to put themselves in potentially dangerous situations. Yeah. The only evidence of trafficking that I see is done by the actions of the city itself. They've been raiding places where people try to work independently here in the city for 300 years. The city is 300 years old. This has been going on forever, but something is happening that's different right now, which is that we're pushing back. 